Hey guys, what's up? It's Dominic here, bringing you the first episode of my Road to Titan as a Town or Nine. And so, yeah, this is the first episode. Just in Crystal 2 at the moment, Crystal League 2. And as you can see, I'm not really using an interesting strategy, just the normal Giants and Barch here. It, I'm, I'm doing this, I'm not going to do this, of course, throughout the series once I hit the high leagues, but. At the moment, I'm just doing a barge because the base is down here. As you can see, my two, oh my bad, two attacks I'm going to show you. Both of them are on really weak Town Hall 9s, which carry quite a good chunk of loot, which I'm taking. Also, display quite a lot of trophies. I think about in these two raids, I gained about 52 trophies. If I'm just off the top of my head, I think it's 52 trophies. But anyway, back to the raid. As you can see, uh, I got f I had five hog riders. Just zoom in on them. They're taking all this bottom side out. I use the rage in the middle, which makes the giants, archers, and my barbarian king absolutely wreck the inside of that base. The queen shooting far over those walls. Brilliant at the moment. Got her to level 11. It's awesome, as you can see. Just use her ability so that she doesn't lose too much health while I'm attacking, and so that I can attack my next attack quicker. And there, so my king full health, queen full health, hogs still standing after destroying about six defenses, which were great. Six defenses with five hogs, I'll take that. But there, as you can see, plenty of troops left over. I've snatched all the loot there and just cleaning the rest of the defenses for that 100% and the 17 trophies it had to offer, as you can see. So now I'm going to bring you the second attack which presents an even higher amount of trophies so, so you can see this guy had about 50,000 more gold and 20,000 more elixir here about 500 more dark elixir so in general it did have a lot more quite a bit more loot here oh, 25 percent more loot and so, so another week town hall 9 it's awesome down here but I'm not here for the loot I'm here for the trophies and once I came across this 35 trophy offer I had to take it and I did of course so it's a weak time on as you can see pink and purple walls exposing atrocious positions the queen right in the corner of her base she won't be doing any damage to my troops as now as you can see my giants take to the top and towards the bottom here very well done there. I'm going to put two heal spells on them and my archers and king will go to the center where there's not really any defenses that will cause them much trouble because all that is there is a mortars and wizard towers so splash damage defenses in the center so it's an atrocious layout I'm sorry bird poo but it was an, it's a terrible base and very rushed very bad and I just I'll just take everything from him there along with 35 trophies so he he does look quite inactive but that's his fault he's doing me a big favor here a big boost to get into crystal one which i should on defense so far and speaking of defense i'll bring you a defense after this attack is over just show you the overall amount of trophies i earned and from this episode i think i gained 52 trophies here which is awesome and just to let you know for this series i will try and place every single attack I do I, I won't be able to manage every defense I do but I will try get every single attack in so I'll bring you my defense against Kelvy here I did win it but sadly as you can see right above that I did lose the next defense because he got 39% not 40% which is a bit sh frustrating but uh, that's what happens there I did lose the next defense, lost quite a lot of Dark Elixir, it was painful. But anyway, getting back to this attack, as you can see, he set it off my giant bombs, he puts 14 hogs down, but it's a Town Hall 8 attack, no, it's a Town Hall 9 actually, level 6 wizards, okay. Anyway, I had wizards in my clan castle, they just destroyed him, destroyed his hogs, destroyed his giants, it's a poor planned attack, he thought he was able to run into this really weird layout. Just to let you guys know, no one's ever got in my town hall in like the past 15 attacks. They've all just attacked from the top. They have managed to get 50%, but fair play to Crypsy for this base design. It has worked 
pretty well to be honest it got me up from gold 2 into like crystal 3 and of course I'm winning defences now but yeah that's not much all he has is uh don't even know where okay he has one archer down here he I just wish he was able to get that gold mine that would have given me a free shield with him only taking a little bit of loot but anyway that's gonna wrap it up for this episode I might as well, I forget it, I may as well bring you the attack from here. So, 68%, as you can see, he did steal, I'll just fast forward it, put it as fast. He did steal all the dark <laughs> elixir, but, see, I had no clan castle troops, I had no, I did, hadn't had time to rearm my traps. He was able to walk into this base with ease, take my dark elixir, take everything. Even my two heroes are down there, as you can see, so... He was lucky, he wasn't good, I'm not going to give him credit for being good, he was just lucky that I had all my traps down, almost all, my heroes down, my clan castle empty, I don't think he'd get anywhere near my dark elixir if he attacked me when everything was ready for me, but oh well that's what happens when I'm not online and get attacked. But as you can see I'm 48 trophies off crystal one, I should hit that on defense, why not just place, put my trophy base on here. Okay, so I got my trophy base on, and in the next episode, I'm probably going to bring you defenses on how I did. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed the start to this series. I will try and hit um, Titan. Don't know how long it'll take. Don't know if it's possible, but I'm going to give it a shot. Definitely should be hitting champion. If I don't, then I suck. Anyway, that's it from me, you guys. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.